this is me this too is me and this is me right now i am a perfect example of one you are what you eat and two nobody was born fat or with the fat gene so today i'm gonna be explaining exactly how i went from this to this in a period of less than two years i've definitely gained a lot of weight i don't know how much weight i have regained stay tuned up to the end of this video because today i'm gonna be measuring my weight and know exactly how much i weigh if you haven't subscribed to this channel please subscribe hit the notification bell and like this video and if you're coming from tiktok i know we have so many subscribers new subscribers from tiktok please say hi in the comment section below this weight did not just come back just like that there are definitely several things that i've been doing so 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 wrong and i've evaluated myself and today i want to list them down the first thing that i started doing wrong was taking back sugar slowly into my diet and by this i mean actual sugar that we put into tea i started taking tea with sugar sometimes sometimes i will not and sometimes i would sugar has contributed a lot in my weight gain as you all know by now sugar is stored as fat into your body the second thing that i did wrong was to get too comfortable with me becoming smaller and focusing more on the physical look you know i assumed that i will not add the weight again the third thing i did wrong was to go back into the normal eating habits of three plus meals a day every single day the fourth thing that i did wrong was to exclude a fasting schedule into my everyday life what i mean by this is to lose weight is not actually a big deal with a little just a little mental change losing weight is actually very easy but the hard part is usually the maintaining part so the thing that i did wrong was to lose all the weight get comfortable and i stopped including a fasting schedule into my everyday routine like to maintain the weight i would have continued doing at least one meal a day or two meals a day but i dived in straight and back slowly but surely into the three or more meals every day and that was a big cause of an increase in my weight the other thing that i definitely did wrong was to start eating everything and anything any time of the day or night that i feel like if i go somewhere where there are people who are eating and i was fasting that day i just say like ah I was fasting but let me just eat and then I will fast again. So I kept procrastinating and saying, "Oh, I'm going to start tomorrow. I'm going to restart the fasting schedule tomorrow." And to this tomorrow tomorrow has turned out into I think almost 2 years now and I have slowly regained almost all of the weight that I actually lost because I can feel it. You guys can also see it. Another very grave mistake that I actually did was to stop drinking water. I shouldn't have stopped drinking water. I used to drink 3 liters of water every day. I'm an advocate of drink water drink water water is healthy 70% of our bodies are made of water and water helps in your body's metabolism and also help to maintain your weight I went from drinking 3 liters of water a day to 2 liters to 1 to almost nothing I'm sure there are very many people who have lost the weight and regained it all back with time there are those people who have struggled with weight all their lives you're there and you're obese or you're overweight You've never known what having a healthy weight actually is. You're always sad. You have a low self-esteem because of your body weight all your life. Don't worry. I have decided as I help myself lose the weight again, I'm going to also be helping you to lose the same weight. Being a perfect example of your what you eat. I'm going to use myself as not as a guinea pig, as a mentor or as an example, as a leader to other people. I'm going to be guiding myself and other people also to be motivated about this weight loss journey that's why i've decided to do it here and also to be accountable i have re-evaluated myself i want to lose all the weight that i've gained and so there are certain steps that i've taken of which i would like you to who wants to lose weight with me because i am restarting my weight loss journey today i would like you to, to try and follow up these steps with me so comment down below if you want to start this weight loss journey let me know how many kgs you weigh and what is your target weight a disclaimer i am not a doctor i am not a nutritionist i am not even a health expert nothing close my love for food and health has made me go out there look for so much information about food health and weight loss all i say here is what works for me and what works for other people there are so many other youtubers and tiktokers talking about intermittent fasting talking about healthy eating habits what you're supposed to eat when you're overweight what you're not supposed to eat 
what you're supposed to do so that you can lose the weight slowly gradually and maintain it it's not just me there are so many people out there so as you follow me here also do your research widely because before i didn't know why we fast and that one fasting looked so heavy and so complicated that i didn't even know exactly what to do or where to start no one taught me i just went online i went on youtube and tiktok and search for all this information that i'm sharing with you take a step search about these things i'm telling you about so that you know what works for you and know what doesn't work for you also if you have a problem or a condition like diabetes type 2 or type 1 high blood pressure kindly consult your doctor so that the doctor can give you a go ahead the first step that i've actually taken in this weight loss journey is to buy a weighing scale this is a very simple weighing scale a very small one very convenient i bought it from jumia at 900 bob it's very important to have a weighing scale in a place that you can easily access it you can take your weight every day and so you can know if you're losing or you're actually gaining the weight the second thing that i've actually done is to buy a water bottle this water bottle is three liters of water you need to take water with you in this weight loss journey because water is very important so you don't want to be remembering in the middle of the day oh i've not taken water i'll be using this water bottle to measure the amount of water that i've taken every day i urge you to buy a water bottle have somewhere at least where you can carry your water and remind yourself there are those ones that are usually written motivational words from here up to here the next step that i've actually taken is to redownload my fasting app there are very many fasting apps you can find them on play store but for me specifically i prefer using the fasting hours tracker let me show you it's right here you can see it it's called the fasting hour tracker so when you open the fasting hour tracker the good thing about this app is that it works even without internet <laughs> in fact i had put a 48 hour fast and i never fasted let me end fast and delete the fast delete this fast it's been 99 days since i last fasted you can imagine how serious that is 99 full days since i last fasted so i've cancelled the fast you're not fasting they've even told me I'm, I'm not fasting let me reopen it again you're not fasting choose a fast from a quick picker below or tap the button to read more about our fast they even know that i'm not i've not been fasting it has a 12 hour fast 16 hours 18 hours 24 hours 36 hours 48 hours 72 hours and a custom fast where you can put if you're fasting for three days and 20 hours you can save and then you start your custom fast it will bring your fasting 90 92 hours i think if you're following me in this weight loss journey please download a fasting app it's going to be very very helpful to show you how many hours exactly you fasted the next thing i'm gonna be doing is to go shopping for this weight loss journey the kind of foods i'll need i'll go to the market and buy all the foods that i'm gonna be using for my weight loss journey because it's very tasking in this weight loss journey when you wake up in the morning and you don't know exactly what you're gonna be eating for the day or you start your week knowing that this week you're gonna be using this fasting protocol yet you don't know exactly what to eat you need to be prepared in advance mentally psychologically you need to go shop so in the next video i'm gonna be taking you shopping and showing you exactly which foods i'm gonna be using for this weight loss journey guys the moment of truth is finally here when i'm going to know exactly how many kgs i weigh and how many kgs i have added the moment that you've all been waiting for for me to take my weight and know exactly how much i weigh after so many days of not fasting let's see exactly how much i weigh so here is my wing scale my wing scale is right here as you can all see so let's take the measurement this is a very nice wing scale by the way you don't have to switch it on it goes on on itself when you step on it so the moment of truth is right here let me step on the scale yeah you can all see 88.90 that's basically 89 <laughs> it's, it's gone off yeah that's basically 89 kg so currently i've already decided on the fasting method that i'll be using to start because right now i'm like a baby in fasting 
I'll be starting with two meals a day. I could easily have started with one meal a day, but because I know we are starting this as many people, it's not only me who's going to be doing this. I'm going to be starting with two meals a day. I'm going to be doing lunch and dinner. You can choose two consecutive meals a day. You can choose to do either breakfast and lunch or lunch and dinner. Eat more protein, vegetables, fats, and very minimal carbohydrates. 12 hours or 16 hours might sound a lot if you say I'm fasting for 12 hours or 16 hours. But remember when you're sleeping, you're also counting the hours, so you're also fasting. So, for example, if you choose to take breakfast at 7 a.m., take your lunch at 1 p.m., and take the next meal at 7 a.m. the next day, you'll already have fasted for 18 hours. So fasting is not as complicated as it seems. I'm going to be starting with taking two consecutive meals a day. I choose to take lunch and dinner, take three liters of water every day, and nothing in between for a whole seven days. That will be one week and see how much weight I lose with that. I'm a very good example that fasting should be a lifestyle. It's not a quick scheme to get thin or to get healthy quickly, but it's actually a lifetime lifestyle that you should stick with as long as you want to keep healthy and that you want to stay fit.